sex ed for people with IDD, healthy relationships. I know some people, they have concerns about, you know, what that feeling is when they're really interested in a person, like a crush. Or like falling in love? Yeah, like falling in love, and they don't know, you know, how to tell the person that they are in love. Well, one thing you could do is flirt. Like, you can smile at someone, or you can compliment their outfit, or you could tell them something you like about their personality. Um, or you can just be bold and tell them, hey, I like you, let's hang out. What happens if I try that and the other person's not interested? Well then, it's time to leave that alone. I mean, if someone isn't interested, they're just not interested and you have to respect that. But don't go bugging them or following them around or, or asking them a whole bunch of times. Well, if uh, I get rejected, that mean there's something wrong with me? No, absolutely not. I mean, sometimes the magic just isn't there. Mm. What should someone do if they're in a relationship and they're unsure whether it's healthy or not? Well, for one, a healthy relationship, um, the people, you know, they enjoy doing things together. They enjoy talking to each other. And sometimes they enjoy doing things not together, like in spending time with their family. But one thing that's really important is that they respect each other and they're both equal in the relationship. That makes sense, but how do you know if a relationship is unhealthy? If a person is not respecting the other person or if they're like trying to control them all the time, that's not really healthy. And if you feel unsafe around that person or you feel like you can't be yourself. That's not really healthy. It's really important in a relationship that people respect each other. That's absolutely right. And I mean, if things aren't healthy or it's not working out well, it's time to get out. Getting out of a relationship can be tricky, but one thing that's important if you're wanting to get out of a relationship is to be honest with the person. Meet with them face to face, you know, talk to them, be kind. If the person keeps trying to pressure you to stay in the relationship, uh, if, but you really feel uncomfortable being in that relationship, it's important to stand your ground and stay firm. Mm -hmm. Like boundaries and respect. Like if someone doesn't want to be in a relationship with mm -hmm. you, you, you got to respect that. Like yeah. anyone would want that kind of respect in return. Exactly. Thanks for chatting with me about this. No problem, happy to do it. Produced by the National Council on Independent Living and Rooted in Rights, with support from the With Foundation.